Hi everyone, this is Dr. Renu Nair, Dermatologist and Hair Transplant Surgeon at Dr. Renu Skin and Hair Clinic, Bangalore. PRP or platelet-rich plasma is one of the popular treatment options for hair regrowth. So what exactly is this PRP? It is something which we prepare from the patient's own blood using a process called as centrifugation. There are different methods of centrifuging and getting the PRP. But the best one is the double spin method where we centrifuge the blood twice. So the first is a soft spin where we remove the RBCs or the red blood cells and we get a clear plasma. And the second is a hard spin where we get this platelet rich plasma which is having concentrated platelets. So how do PRP work? Inside these platelets we have a lot of growth factors. So when they are active they help in skin healing skin regeneration and hair growth. So we have a lot of areas where we use PRP out of which the commonest is for hair fall and hair thinning. So we can use in conditions like androgenetic alopecia, female pattern hair loss and other hair loss conditions. Apart from hair loss, we also use PRP for skin. We can use it for various type of scars, especially the acne scars and for skin rejuvenation and anti-aging procedures. PRP works by uh, stimulating the hair follicles and promoting hair growth. It has to be done as multiple sessions. Generally, we do three to six sessions once in a month to get the best results. Now, the main question about PRP is how painful it is. PRP, unfortunately, is an injection. So some amount of pain is there, but we try to reduce it to the maximum by first applying a numbing cream on your scalp followed by giving you a local anesthesia and also using other devices like cooling and vibratory devices. So this makes the injections much painless. So after preparing the PRP, we then inject into the hair follicles. So this growth factors from the PRP, it goes and stimulates the stem cells of the hair, promoting hair growth and reducing hair thinning and ultimately reducing the hair loss. In case of skin treatments, we combine PRP with other modalities like microneedling radiofrequency, fractional lasers and mesotherapy or the derma rollers. Coming to the safety of PRP, it is very safe procedure because it is something which is prepared from your own blood. What can be the complications after PRP? So as I said, it is a safe procedure but some amount of pain can be there. So after the treatment, if you have a lot of pain, we provide painkillers like paracetamol and some amount of swelling can be there on the scalp which after doing a gentle massage goes away. So you should not wash your hair for at least 6 hours after the treatment so that the PRP gets absorbed into the scalp properly. So if you are suffering from hair loss, hair thinning and also if you want to do some skin rejuvenating treatments, please discuss with your dermatologist about this latest treatment and you can go ahead with it. Thank you.